Welcome back. The city of Charlotte is growing at a rapid pace. With that growth, though, local farmers, they are worried their farms could be put at risk. Farming advocates say the city is on track to lose more than 19,000 acres of farmland by 2040. And now there's a push to conserve that land. WCNC Charlotte's Kaylin Hagwood is giving us a closer look at that effort tonight. Well, farmers say preserving their land is one of their biggest concerns as the city continues to grow, but one group says they're doing what they can to ensure that farmland stays that way forever. Wisdom Jazar and his family have spent the last five to six years farming in Charlotte as part of their business, Deep Roots CPS Farm. As the city grows, he worries if local farms like his will have a place. That's the million dollar question right there is, you know, how is the city working to make sure that there's a productive and a local food system. While the city says it does have policies to encourage farming, it doesn't classify farms specifically as farmland, which can make it easier to turn farms into neighborhoods as the area grows. And we haven't had that in 20 years, but that does not mean we cannot have a designation now. At-large councilwoman Dimple Ajmira says a farmland designation is something she's been advocating for, especially in areas where healthy food is harder to come by. I will be talking to our planning director. In fact, I've already talked to her about it to see how we can continue uh, or how we can actually improve our efforts to preserve our farmland. The discussions come as one organization is hoping to take farmland preservation to the next level. The Carolina Farms Fund is working to ensure local farms will never become anything else through easement, a legally binding process. We're looking at, at properties in Mecklenburg and, and throughout that 15 county region, but those areas that have heavy development pressure um, and where that pressure is butting up against agricultural production. That's really where we're looking to step in and try and conserve that acreage so that farmland stays in agriculture. The group hopes to preserve at least 5,000 acres of land in the Charlotte region by purchasing existing farmland and ensuring it stays designated for farmers. He says they'll then sell that land to farmers who want to expand. Which makes us safer and more secure in our food system. Multiple efforts towards supporting a system that works to support us. Oh, the farmers provide for the restaurants, for the schools, for the uh, businesses, etc. Councilwoman Ajmira says the city will continue its community area planning into the new year if anyone wants to make a comment. Kaylin Hagwood, WCNC Charlotte.